Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Ed Shear with another 7 Days to Die video inside the Eden Centre Mall. Um, overnight I um, finished a, um, the, the second uh, ladder, this side, to go up to the roof. So we've got, we've got access to the roof from both sides now. Um, and I've just been chopping down some trees. Um, I had a bit of trouble with some zombies uh, overnight. There was a screamer and a bunch of other zombies came in. but. Um, managed to deal with those uh, I think well, um, I'll probably put the footage in uh, as the intro so um, we'll leave that there um, there has been a zombie around here somewhere oh in fact there, there he is I can see him he's coming in from outside knocking that wall so I've been hearing him hitting away for a while now so I'll just leave him doing that while I knock these trees down uh, just replanting them basically so um, we can, uh, yeah, we'll continue with this this pattern of the trees, I think. I mean, these benches, um, can you take these apart? You can. They just you just get wood from them, that's fine. We'll just take them, why not? Um, I think I did mess up the, the pattern a little bit of the tree. Oh, I did, yeah, look, the planning's off. Oh, well. Shame. Shame for me. Shame for the tree and me. Um, so yeah, I think yesterday we kind of, um, what did we do? We got our, our garden going um, and we started the process of, um, and we didn't actually start that, but we, we were talking about starting the process of kind of clearing the stairs and everything. So I think that is something we need to get started on um, because... It might take a little while. So I think today what I'm going to do is go around the stores and get whatever resources that I can get that I've left behind. Oh, there's a zombie here somewhere. Um, that I haven't picked up along the way. And, uh, hello. Where, where are you going, lady? Why, why? Oops, wrong way. She knows the place better than me. And she's got no head. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, get all the resources that I have left behind um that's a not a good place for a tree is it next to my um thing uh, i think i'll leave yeah i'll put that there that's okay this place is like the tree sanctuary area um orchid orchid orchard 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 that's what they're called yeah um so that's all the planting done that'll do for now um we'll get continue with those trees uh, I need a bit of food. It did take a little bit of damage overnight, so let's just have a drink, and uh, we'll just eat a, I don't know, a ravioli? That'll do. Have some ravioli, um, and I'll have a bandage to get my max health back up, and I think we'll get... Will that get us to full health? We're almost at full health. We need one, five more health. Pairs. That'll get us to five more health. There we go. Nice. I think I got a, a perk or a, a recipe or something that gives you honey from trees. Because I've knocked down some trees and I've got three jars of honey from those trees, which is nice. Um, I think uh, I think that was something that I... A recipe that I picked... Or not a recipe, but a, a perk that I must have learned or picked up along the way somewhere. Because uh, I don't think you get that as standard. I think that's like a, an extra thing that you can get. So, that's quite good. Um, and we did level up overnight. So, um, we have got one spill, uh, skill point to spend. Uh, so, I'm just thinking about what to do with it. I mean, do we start going into... Gunslinger is quite a good one. You get 10% more damage. 
Uh, that is actually quite a good perk. I think we should get that because I've got a pistol and I've got quite a lot of ammo for it. So, yep, yeah, I'm going that one. And, okay, let's, uh, we're, we're going to go back through systematically the, the, the mall and get all the, the resources, you know, like the piles of rock and stone and all that kind of stuff, um, and cobblestone, anything that we've missed, we'll get the, all those things. So, I'm just going to start in this shop here um, and pick up all these things, you know, like tires. I don't know what you get from tires, but let's... You just plastic parts, okay. And what about this bumper? Oh, I think you'd probably get yeah plastic parts for that. Door. Oh yeah, that'll be the iron. Right, I'm gonna just get rid of all these things because we'll get all the resources from them. iron and plastic and all that. Oops, wrong thing. So that's what we'll do. Okay, yeah, I think that's enough for this store. We've got uh, a lot of the, the resources here, so we I might uh, take the stuff that I've just uh, gathered and put it into the forge because that can get that can start forging up. I can hear a zombie somewhere. Put that in there. Yeah, why not? Uh, put the one stone in there. Oh, hello. There he is. There's two of them. Oops, I missed. Oh, there's, there's three of them. Where did these guys come from? You guys can just stay out of my mall. Good. Dealt with those guys. Right, what was I doing? Uh, smelting, smelting, doing a bit of smelting. Um, so I think, well, we'll just leave that for now. We don't really need to smelt anything right now. Are those made of lead or? Um... No, oh, there's a. Ow! Oh damn it! He set me on fire. Bastard. Uh, need a drink. I don't have one on me. Whoa! Where'd you come from? Um, let's get her quick. Oh, damn it. Thought I was going to get her before she screamed. Um, okay, let's have a little bit of um, first aid while we're waiting for those guys to turn up. And a drink. Have a bit of that. There we go. Now, where are these guys spawning in from? You can hear them. Hello. Welcome to the mall. Damn zombies. There's a nurse. Oops. Good. Dealt with her. Um, I, did, I forgot. I didn't check these things here. Uh, okay, good. Right, well, um, what was I up to? I was putting stuff in the forge. That's what I was doing before I got rudely, dis, uh, rudely interrupted by a bunch of crazy dudes. Uh, actually, they don't, I need to take rid of this. Get rid of this thing as well. All right, get some more honey. Yep, cool. Got some honey. Good. Okay, so uh, there's more. There's more somewhere. Um, I've got quite a lot of iron on me, and I think what I'll do is make as much junk turret ammo because I think that will be important for us moving forward. Having more junk turret ammo. So I'm just going to keep building that, that'll be good. So where on earth are these guys? I can 
hear them down here somewhere. There he is, there's one. Uh, let's move out of his way a bit. Whoops. I think these are the guys that uh, got spawned in by the screamer. Down you go. There we go. Any more? No, I think that's them all for now. Now there's zombies respawning here. Okay, well we'll just... It's fine. We'll just... Uh, kill them all. We need the XP, so... Whoa, dude. Oh, man. Okay. He, he got a lot closer than I thought, actually. Let's check this quick. Got some bullets there. Whoa, slow yourself up there, mate. Uh, I'm just going to repair my bat, because I think that needs a bit of repairing. And let's get the junk turret. Oh, damn. I left it over there, didn't I? Let's go get the junk turret. So there's a zombie in here, definitely. Oh, it's this guy. Oh, okay. Well, I might just leave him. He can um, make his own way. I think there's a way... Oh, no not been bashed in completely well we'll let them we'll let him just bash his way out eventually he might actually just despawn when I go away from this area I'm not sure yeah you just keep hitting that mate that's fine quite a few of these um, radiators, don't we? You know what we could just do with is a storage chest next to the um, forge because um, we can oh, we can just put all our forgeable things in here uh, and uh, yeah, we'll scrap that and have we got a Screamer coming after us. Yep, sounds like it. Getting a lot of screamers today. There's been this I think this is the fourth this is the fourth screamer. I don't know. Oh Hello. I'm like stood on her head. Ow. So Yeah, screamers, uh, if anyone doesn't know what a screamer does, basically these screamers they're really easy to kill, but um Basically, if you let them scream, they spawn in about six or eight zombies that just sort of um, just get spawned and come after you. So it's kind of like a mini little horde that... Here we go, there they are. So they, the, these have been spawned in by the by the screamer. Um, you know what, I've got my junk turret. Let's just get him, get him used. Loot bag. Okay. Yeah, so streamer screamers are quite an annoyance. I mean they they just randomly spawn in um and come in and try and bring bring zombies with them. 
uh, which are kind of annoying. I mean, obviously, the, the level of the zombies that they spawn in depends on your your game stage in the game. So if, uh, you know, your your game, the higher your game stage, the, the harder the zombies are that get spawned in. It's basically how it works. That's my understanding of it, anyway. Um, right, so continue what we were doing. Getting stuff in the forge. And getting them forged down. Right. I think we've got enough. You know what, let's just cook all the cement we can. Get that made. And, uh, yeah, we'll leave everything else for now. The clay can go in there. Oh, they can go in there. I think that's it for now. Yep, good. Okay, so uh, the next thing that I was going to do is uh, the shotgun messiah shop, which I think is down here. I think on top of the that uh, platform thing, there was a load of those stone blocks. And actually, there's loads of stuff that can be taken apart in here still that we didn't do before. So um, that's what I'll do next. We'll get these... Oh, yeah, we'll... we'll Spawn in all the zombies first. Hello. Oops. I think there's a guy up there, so be careful with him knocking coming down. So let's let's just lead them out and we'll do the same thing. Get the get the chunk of turret on the go. Yeah, I think up here there's um, some things that we didn't get before as well, isn't there? So let's jump up here quick. Yeah, these um, stone things. You get quite a bit of stone out of these. Um, I think you get about 60 or maybe even more than that. Yeah, you get, you get 69 stone out of one block of that. It's quite a good amount of stone for that just small block, really. And they're not very hard to take apart, so it's quite good. You also get quite a lot of XP for doing that as well. These are... Oh, these are a lot harder, these blocks. These are just cobblestone blocks. I think I'm going to leave those because they're... Well, they'll take a long time for me to take apart. But I will take these apart because we'll get paper out of these. I'm going to leave all these boxes because if we live long enough to day 30, the the loot that was inside them will respawn. Um, so whatever, you know, and, you know, if we get that far, I'm not sure we will, but if we get to level to day 30, then the, the loot will respawn, which will be quite handy. Um, you don't get very much wood out of these pallets. Yeah, they're kind of not really worth it. So I can see down there, there's loads of cement and cobblestone, because we, we can take all that apart, that'd be good. I think there might be some zombies... nope, okay. No zombies at the moment. These haven't respawned. Uh, and all these... Um, these shelving, uh, we can take all these apart, we get a load of iron out of them. So, let's get these as well, why not? Okay, uh, I got yeah 204 uh, uh, iron from all those things. I mean, we've got more to get, but we don't need that much more right now. So I'll leave the rest. We can come back for that later. Uh, I'm going to get these cements and cobblestones, though, because we can use that for building uh, and can finish up our or do some repairs to our horde base uh, if we need it. So... Here a zombie somewhere. I think he might be outside again. We're getting a lot of the burning zombies coming in from outside because we are in the burnt biome. Um, 
mean, that's fine. They just keep coming in. We'll just keep killing them. Get the XP for them. The zombies in here. Uh, whoa! How did how did she spawn from there? I just stopped there. Hmm. So another zombie spawned. Hmm. Interesting. These guys are spawning in from all over the place. It's fine with me. Um, there's brass things there. I'll come back for them. I think we've got enough brass for now. Don't think we need all that brass um, for now. Now, I'm not sure about these things. These are not... Nah, they're not um, farm plots, are they? Oh, we get nitrate out of them, though. Oh, okay. Okay, good. Uh, again, there's more shelving in there. We can take all that apart. There's more. There's loads of shelving in there. So that's uh, a good... Oh, hello. There's a zombie there. She spawned in. Hello. Ow. Come on. Oh, damn. I'm out of stamina. I, I really need to keep an eye on my stamina levels. Something I should really do. Oh, I've just leveled up. That's good. I think what I'll do... Um, I want to get the... Um, electrical engineering mod. Uh, let me just kill these zombies first. There we go. Um, yeah, what was I saying? I could do with getting the... Uh, it's this one, isn't it? No, it's this one. Electrician. Learn how to craft generators. Yeah. So we need to get to intellect level 6. So... From now on, I'm just going to be putting points into intellect until we get to level 6. That's all I'm investing in, I think. More zombies in there. Hello. Okay, well, we'll just do this and same old story. All the zombies coming out of Raya's video store there. You don't really get a lot of sand. I mean, you get barely any sand out of sandbags. Which is a bit strange. I thought you'd get a good amount of sand out of them. Uh, let's use the axe in this. Get plastic parts for that. Oh, I've missed some loot there. What am I doing? Okay, that's all to be left. That'll respawn, hopefully. Oh, hello. Where did you come from, lady? I thought I woke up all the zombies in this shop. She's down. More, more iron there. Yep, we can take all that apart, no probs. Uh, don't think there's anything useful in there. Oh. We've got a uh, spider monkey. Zombie, whatever they're called. Oh, we've got a couple of them. Ow. Damn you. Just die. We might have to get the big ones out. Oh my god. We've got, we've got like a, a four of these. Come on. Okay, it's getting a bit full on.
reload the trunk door. The deal. Quite a few zombies coming in. Okay. That was quite a lot. They're all coming in from outside, those guys. Yeah, I've checked that wood, that stuff there. Um, wow, okay. Right, so if we um, have a look at the the way, the path that these zombies are going to take. I mean, they need to come. Oh, they need to go all the way around there. I don't know if they'll they'll figure that path out, you know. It's a bit convoluted for them. Maybe we should just make one from here, like a ramp. It might be easier. I think we'll, we'll probably do something like that. I will have a think about that. Decide the best way forward. I'll eat some of that food. And I'll use a bandage. Get myself back up to strength. Now let's head back up to the forge. Check out what's going on. How we're getting on. Yep, that's finished. So let's get some more of this on. You just get iron for that, don't you? Yeah. Stone. We've got clay. We've got this clay on. And uh, we'll take that. We'll get the rest of the cement cooked out of it. Oh, there's a screamer again. Whoa! Damn you, zombie. Zombie screamer. Has she spawned in more zombies? Probably. It's not a very good time for this to happen. It's nearly 10pm. Um, I think we might be okay this time. I think we got away with it. Yep, sounds like it. Can't hear anything. Well, I think uh, I'll, I'm going to leave the video here. Uh, if anything exciting happens overnight, I might, I'll might i probably include that. But um, if not, this will be the end of the episode. Uh, I don't know. Well, we kind of got a lot of resources today. We did kill quite a few zombies, actually. We did seem to have quite a lot of people coming in and screamers. So we got we leveled up twice today, which is nice. Uh, so that's good. So anyway, um, I'll leave the video here and um, I will... Uh, hopefully see you in the next one. Thanks and goodbye.